Hello and welcome to another Access UTV episode. My name is Michelle Edhouse and today I'd like to talk to you about what bugs you when somebody says something and is it actually their point of view that's bugging you? So scenario A. <laughs> Today um, we had somebody come to our home and he made a comment about to, to my husband about oh so that's where the kids get it from and it just niggled and niggled and niggled and niggled and niggled and niggled and niggled at me until finally I was in the shower and I just got so angry and so worked up about it I was like this has got to change so I called Glennon and I said to him can you facilitate me on this please because it's really 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 bugging me and um I went over the scenario and what I started to see as I recounted what was going on and um my points of view about what the person had said and what I had perceived that to mean was actually it was all the places that I had been judging me and I had been judging my children that by him saying it made me look at them made me see those places that I'd been judging and um, it was all the places that I aligned and agreed with or resisted and reacted to what he was saying and um, but it was and but and and it was all the places that I was making me wrong or my children wrong for certain behaviors and him saying it was just how dare he bring that to light and that was what was making me so angry um, and so once I had pocked and potted my points of view about me, my points of view about my children, and my points of view about him being willing to voice what <laughs> what I had been unwilling to acknowledge. It actually cleared all of that anger, all of that rah out of my world. And it just was really interesting, having done so many years of clearing my points of view, clearing my judgments that there was still something that racked me up quite so much so um what is racking you up what is making you go Rah! and is it anything to do with where somebody is acknowledging something that you've been unwilling to acknowledge about you or about someone you seriously care about seriously wow that's an interesting way of saying it isn't it i seriously care about you not a happily, joyfully, wonderfully bouncy. Anyway, pock and pot all that. All that. So, um, yeah. What is it? Is it something that is that you've been resisting looking at? Is it something that you have been um, judging you, judging somebody else that you care about, and not willing to acknowledge it? And when somebody else brings it up, it digs all of that stuff up and makes you go no 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 i'm not judging that ah oh, how dare they judge that ah oh. just a question that may open something up for you may change something for you may give you some clarity about something and uh what else is possible what if you didn't hide your points of view from yourself and you acknowledge them and once you acknowledge them, you can actually choose whether you wish to keep them. So thanks so much for joining me here at Access UTV. And what else is possible if you had no judgment?